Shorty Award nomination. Now many of you may say, Dame, what is a Shorty Award? That's what I was saying a few years back when it first popped up. I was never ever nominated. This is the 10th annual Shorty Awards and they have all different type of categories for everything that happens right here on social media. Whether it's Twitter, Instagram, whether it's television, whether it's YouTube, whatever the case may be, you have celebrity categories, your best celebrities, your top celebrities for 2017. The category I'm in is food. Now, I'm up against some heavy hitters in the game. So, congratulations to everyone that was nominated for the food category for the Shorty Awards. However, Foodie Fam, if you are so ever inclined, in the link below, you click the link, you can vote for your boy on the Shorty Awards, all right? In the food category. I mean, sure, it'd be nice to win, but it doesn't matter who wins at the end of the day. For the Foodie Fam gets it popping regardless, regardless, all right? And this kind of crept up on me from left field. So again, I'm happy to be nominated. If you guys want to vote, there's a link in the description box below. First link, click on that thing, get your notifications on, rock with your boy the long way. What's going on, people? It's your main man, Dame Drops, YouTube Food Titan, right here rocking with you on Taste Buds. The hot topic, French fries. Different type of French fries from different given locations. And now it's time to break all of them down. Well, guess what? I'm gonna bring my boy, a certified chef in the game. He knows food. I know food. You know food. Let's bring out all these French fries. Let's figure this out together as a team. What you made me a Dame Drop. You know right here on Taste Buds, I'm feeding you visually, baby. Y'all sitting there, you're like, Dame, what you doing right now? And who's in the ride with you? I got my main man, Alvin Kylon, right here. The ex slut aficionado, right here. The ex slut monster don, right here. When it came to the ex slut, this man was behind the ex slut, and now he's bringing you hot <laughs> fire from the ex slut. Oh, no, man. Man, how happening? are you, dude? Man, I'm sitting here maintaining the best way I know how. Yeah, but man. I'm thinking. Food is the mood right now. Hell yeah. What you know about that fast food game, and more so, the french fries of the fast food. I consider myself a dissector of, of what is good in fast food. Ooh. Especially like fast food french fries. Yeah. There's a reason that you have to go to a McDonald's, you know what I'm saying, yeah. or an in and out for the fry game. Yeah. You can't make these joints at home. Yeah, they perfect You can't them. do it the way McDonald's does it. No, dude, I gotta get the Mickey D's, man. I gotta get the Mickey D's. I'll tell you what, man, like, I'm f I'm from Los Angeles. I grew up there. I'll go to In-N-Out and I'll get a double double. Mm. Sometimes I get a three by three. Boss. And then I'll drive up the street to McDonald's and get some French fries, like that. Cause I'm not a real big fan of In-N-Out French fries. You mm. know what I mean? Like they're good, but they're not McDonald's good. Say it again. They're not McDonald's. Wow. Good. Just like that. Wow. 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 For a lot of individuals that do not know. When you slide the Mickey D's and you want those fresh fries, you gotta ask for them with no salt on those joints. They gotta make you a fresh batch. Dude, I take it to the next level. I'll tell them, fries better be fresh or I'm sending it back. Yo, five cheers on that one. Cheers. Dude. I'll roll the window down, they give it to me. You be like, you be like don't go nowhere. I'll be like, yes. Make them again. Make them again. It has to be crispy, mm -hmm. fluffy on the inside. Oh, yes. And nice and salty. I love well, it. I mean, let's get into it, man. Let's see if that's what <laughs> we have here, bro. I like the soft ones. I'm gonna find the soft one. See, I, I like this too. This is good too. Sometimes you gotta get that little like. Sometimes it's you gotta sat there. You in gotta the get oil. that like after yeah. session. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's like <laughs> you know why not? Yeah, as long as you get these McDonald's fries fresh, you're gonna love them. Yeah. Not just like them, you're gonna love them. Yeah. But if they're not fresh, you're gonna have an attitude problem. For sure. That would be the contour of McDonald's Yo, French fries. The spectrum, is, the spectrum yeah. is ridiculous. Yeah, it's like, like day and night. It can be like ecstasy, mm -hmm. and it can just be agony. Oh. Exactly. I got something for you, bro. I got something for you, bro. Bum, ba, da, bum. What you know about the Popeyes fry game? Oh. What you know about the Popeyes fry Popeyes. game? Popeyes. Well, first of all, this is, this is what's weird about the Popeyes fries. Mm -hmm. 
What the f is that coating? That's how they do when they what say is the that, spice though? is nice. Uh, do they like dredge them? It's, it's the Cajun fry game. It's gonna be a little bit different. Gonna have a little. Gonna have the lumps and the mumps all up over yeah. the batter that matters. See what? this. This is this is what other places have to do. Right. To compete with the McDonald's crispy French fry. You know what's dope about these? Is that you can order a side of gravy. Mm-hmm. And dip them up in the gravy, gravy right, right? Yeah. I mean, the Popeye's fries, to no surprise, have the flavor. Right. Still, still, in comparison to a McDonald's fry, nah, they would be lacking just a little bit. Right. But they bring their own respect to the French fry For table sure. game. For sure. The Cajun then. Yeah. Um, Yes, sir. I'm going to throw you for a loop this time. Let's go. I'm going to take you all the way to the left side of the field. Let's do it. I want to see this. Burger King chicken fries. Not just a regular uh, fry, man. Yeah. Yeah. A little I, bit of BK action. I call this the airport special. Okay. Well, why the airport special, Because they always got a Burger King at the airport, and this is what I always get. This is what you end up getting right here? Hell yeah. As a as a chef and, and representing the chef you me, I'm pretty sure like the first thing is is like where the f does this come from? Like what part of the chicken does this come from? <laughs> I know that Burger King changes their fries all the time. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure this is a, this is them saying, you know what, fuck the potato fry game. Let's just change the game in general and right. just create our own and call them chicken fries. You really can't go wrong with the chicken fry. Let me go ahead and beat this thing up. Yeah. All right. I mess with these, man. Uh, did they hit this thing with a 4C seasoning? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what it is, man. Alvin? Yes, sir. I'm not even done yet, because <laughs> I got that fire. You By now, I know you know Chick-fil-A gets oh, down with sure. that waffle fry game. Of course. Listen. All right. I got something for you. Here we go. OK. I got something for Diversity. Myself. I like the diversity right now. Yeah, I'm already off the top. Now, in comparison, though, in comparison okay. to like shoestring fries, chicken fries. What are you? What is your take on waffle fries? It, it's novelty. I love it. You know what I mean? Like you wonder, like how do they get them like this? You're not just eating one fry at a time. This is like eight fries at a time. Look at it. The big boy in me loves these. Getting excited every time. Yeah. You see oh yeah, yeah. And you know what's dope about these two is that it creates a really cool platform. Mm -hmm to shove a sauce in it. Look at the, the rigidness, it holds. Bro. It's made to hold sauce. It is woven to near perfection. Yeah. Well, it's a waffle and a fry. Can't mess with that. Look, man, I know we ran through a lot of fries, right. but we can't talk about French fries, okay. regular shoestring fries, waffle fries, chicken fries. What, what I'm taking is curly fries. Oh, man. Arby's. Curly fries. They're not, they're not my favorite ones. Again, because they're coating. I don't know what it is with me and coating. You don't like coating? I don't know, I don't like to coat. I think it's cheating. But okay, so this, not a big fan of. But the one, the, the, the one that you do like are these bad boys. They're like little really coiled up ones. Tell you what, they like probably the most flavor. Yeah, yeah, they have the most flavor in it. They have like- The flavor's yeah. compact, right? Yeah, it, it sucks up all the seasoning. Let me see. You know? You know what's also good about the curly fry? It's when you get regular fries and there's one curly fry that's in the regular fries. Five yeah, that was like the one coveted piece. Yeah. Like you can be with four of your homies and there's a, a, a plate of french fries mm -hmm. and everyone sees that one curly fry. And the one dude that picks it up is the <laughs> I like the fact that they didn't want to go the simple route and be like everybody else. Right. They wanted to create that action fry right. where you were just like okay i can hold the fry like this it's curled up coiled up i can play with it just yeah. a little bit you know yeah and i'm I taking see that. flavor you know within the circles within the rings the rings of flavor. right lord of flavor right Again, you know? yeah. it's a great option when you don't feel like just being basic oh. bro we've been through it i'm carved up we have been through it man <sighs> we ran through the crazy spectrum of french fries yes sir and now we have to weigh in on these fries okay okay all okay right? so I, i'm gonna start with <clears throat> of all the fries which one would you say was the most crispy i'd go i'd give it to mcdonald's man yeah yeah i think mcdonald's was the crispiest one okay okay could definitely respect that i'm in my head i'm like it's crazy but arby's, arby's gets it Arby's gets a oh, Arby's yeah, gets okay. crispiness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ar they, is there like, something about that deep, hard fry supply? Right. And it's all curled up. Yeah. Like they go through a lot to make yeah. it crispy. Yeah. 
let's talk about the best season French fries. Definitely, definitely gotta go with Popeyes. Mm, gotta right. agree. Popeyes, Popeyes is serious. Popeyes was perfect. It was seasoned. They had pepper on it. They had salt on it. It was good. And it had that bite bag. Blah, you're like, oh, Dude. who was that? This is the part that I love. Right. The best in class, like the best overall fry okay. of what we tried today. Ah, that's a tough one. Yeah, man, man I had to hit you with the curveball. That's a tough one. I'm, I'm, you know what? I thoroughly enjoyed the chicken fry. Ooh, okay. Thoroughly enjoyed the chicken fry from Burger King. I'm, I'm Mickey D's, man. Yeah. I'm Mickey Yo, you know, happy in the you know, fry. I, I love Mc, I love McDonald's. I love McDonald's. You know what I mean? Like it's, it, it's great, but I'm gonna go with the fried chicken. Alvin, man. Yo. Thanks for having me. Come on, man. You know how we roll, bro. Yes, sir. It's my pleasure. But yeah, I man. know you ain't about to leave me high and dry. Never. So you get up out of here. Never, man. I'm going to give you a couple of tips. We'll chef it up. We're going to up your fry game. Okay. All right? Sorry. I hate when people do this. Because what happens is all the steam and the heat from the french fries create moisture and makes your fries soggy. Oh. Leave the bag open. Let them breathe. Let let the air, let the fragrance come out, you know what I mean? Second, everyone sees in the beverage dispenser area, there's always lemons. You squeeze some of this lemon juice in here. Then you get pepper. And you just crack Is this some. ghetto lemon pepper? Oh boy, yeah! <laughs> <This is> ghetto lemon. <laughs> yes, <What's> sir. <laughs> yo, yo, lemon what pepper. Doing, yeah? Lemon pepper <laughs> is my jam. Then you get your French fries. Yeah, you gotta have the fries. Right? And you just uh oh uh oh uh oh uh oh blah, 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 blah. oh like that boom lemon pepper fries lemon pepper fries the man knows flavor the man knows food I'm not bringing anybody here on taste buds if they don't know anything about food Thank I'm your you main so man much. James drops YouTube food titan you know this has been another crazy episode because that's all I ever bring you like feeding you baby visually taking care of your appetite now get right and have a good night Ooh. <laughs>